In this video, we'll explore how to turn still images into lip-synced videos that sound totally natural. Just like me. Oh, forgot to mention. I used to be a PNG file and now basically an influencer thanks to DSign. Hey, it's Mia. Today I'll show you how to bring any image to life using DSign's new lip syncing feature. It's surprisingly easy and I'll walk you through some fun ways to use it for storytelling, content creation, or just to impress your friends. Let's jump right in. First from the project workspace, head to the left toolbar. Click on AI video and then select lip sync to open the tool. Now it's time to upload our image. Under face image, click to upload a picture. If there is already a character or person on your canvas, you'll see them here and then you can just select the layer instead. I, I want to use this cartoon face first. Right now, this feature works best with real human faces or human-like cartoon characters. For the best results, it is recommended to use a high-quality, well-lit portrait. Ideally, a close-up of the upper body. The bigger and clearer the face, the better your video will look. Once we upload our image, we'll see the adjustment screen. And here we can set the aspect ratio and zoom in or out and reposition the face in the frame. Click done when we're happy with the framing of the character. We can tweak it later by clicking adjust face. And if we want to use a different image, we can click re-upload to upload a new one. Next, click pick a voice under speaking voice to decide how your character will speak. We have two options. For text to speech, we can type in what our character should say and design will generate the voice. And we can also upload audio to use our own recorded audio file. Let's start with text to speech. We can enter text up to 140 characters per input. And here we can choose different languages and select a voice here. Click preview to hear a sample. Find a comfortable place to lie down. Make sure and you're Hey, are you looking for a fresh and engaging voice for your podcast or social media? I think this one sounds more like my character. Let's put in the text. For certain words like brand names, you might want to spell them out phonetically so the AI pronounce them correctly, like design in this case. Also, note that even small punctuation marks like uh, commas or exclamation marks can completely change the tone of your sentence. Let's click generate and play audio to preview the audio. I use design and now my work looks suspiciously good. Let's try a different punctuation. I use design and now my work looks suspiciously good. Another one. I use design and now my work looks suspiciously good. So you see how just one little symbol can totally shift the tone. You can play around to see how differently your message can come across. When we're happy with the audio, click generate to send the audio to lip sync with a character. I use design and now my work looks suspiciously good. I feel a little guilty but not enough to stop. Don't tell my boss. Now let's try uploading our own audio. But first, let me change the face to a realistic woman here. With the option to upload our own audio, we can use our voice, a pre-recorded clip, or even a singing vocal. The audio can also be in any language, even sound effects or made up words. Just keep the file under 10 seconds and below 20 megabytes. Supported formats include MP3, WAV, M4A, and AAC. I'm going to upload the singing audio and see if we can make her sing. Soft kitty, warm kitty, little ball of fur. Happy kitty, sleepy kitty, purr, purr, purr. Can you believe we just made a photo scene? I did generate the song in two separate segments because of the time limit, but once stitched together, it actually plays seamlessly as a complete tune. 
And here are a few fun ways you can use lip sync. We can bring back historical figure and make them speak. If you want to find the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. Anime influencer for product review. Just try D Sign Super Hot Chips. Yes, D Sign makes chips now. Didn't know my taste buds could cry, but I still ate the whole thing. We can even sync images with music tracks with vocals. Also, we can stitch together lip sync characters to tell a story. You've been in bed all day. I'm conserving energy. For what? Surviving this conversation. <laughs> and there are just so many fun ways to play with lip sync. Let us know in the comment below what you love to create with this feature. Hope you found this tutorial helpful. Try it yourself using the link below. And I'll see you in the next one. Happy creating!